Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for always coming back to watch my content. I really, really appreciate it. If you're new here, you're so much welcome. My name is Daisy. Please consider subscribing to my channel and also don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. So I'm coming live from Uganda, as you can see on my top, the Pearl of Africa. And I have, this one is 20,000 um, Ugandan shillings. It's like $5 and I want us to see what $5 can get you here in Owino market, which I believe is the biggest market here in Africa, here in Uganda. So we just want to walk and then let's see how, uh, what this money can actually get you in Owino market. So uh, it gives me vibes of, what is it called this market? Um, the largest market in Kenya. It's called Gikomba Market. So here you'll get literally everything. Food, you'll get clothes, you'll get any, any other thing that you want, you'll get it in this um, video. So we want to get food stuff with 20,000 uh, Ugandan shillings and let's see what it can get you. Welcome to Owino Market, which is the largest market in Uganda and it was established as a result of 320 traders being shifted from Nakasero Market, which by then had become very popular and the government had decided to decongest it. So how did Owino Market come into place? There once lived an elderly trader called Owino who was already famous in the area. Owino would roast maize and potatoes in the area before traders from Nakasero arrived. As the market grew, people did not forget the elderly Owino. They would refer to the market as Owino Market and that is how this market got its, its name. Owino Market sits at an area of 0 0.4 hectares and accommodates more than 50,000 traders, most of whom are women. So guys, the first thing that we are going to buy is this one. They call it as mangata. This, but us in Kenya, we call it what is it called? I I I forget the name. So we buy for a thousand uh, Ugandan one thousand. shillings. And that one. Oh, and this one. So this one for one one thousand each. Yeah. Just oh come closer. For two, of course. For one Show it. So this one, guys. Yeah. One. One thousand. Yeah, one thousand. How much you're selling? Is one thousand. it a bunch of one thousand, right? Six. So this one you call it as, as Sandra, guys, but they call it as. Thank you. Okay, take mm -hmm. So, guys, you see these people still use. Um, they still use nylon, but in Kenya we don't use this one. So I'm really surprised that they still use the nylon. Yeah. So. This is fashion fit. Yeah, between that. We don't see you as in that. We don't see between that. We don't have this type. You see that type? Ours there are very many types. I had so many called Muganda. Muganda? Is it which one? Not yeah. even there. What's next? You need, yes. you need this one? So this is how their currency looks like. This one is 10,000 Ugandan shillings. And then we have, this one is 5,000. This is how it looks like. And then we have 1,000. So I have a balance of 18,000. No, leave alone that one. This is the lips. We are not taking you. How much is okra? Lukumi, one thousand. Just give her that coin. Coin, coin. But the one that's there. So we're buying okra. It goes for one thousand Ugandan shillings. And I'm surprised because the okra looks like vegetable. But me, I'm used to the one that looks like. It's, yeah, the long one. <laughs> We go, you so, paper bag also. Okay. So, yeah, what's the one? Onions. Onions. Yeah. Oh, they are big. This one is how much? 
buy this one. 5,000? Yeah. So guys, the next thing that you are getting is onions. They are going for 5,000. Oh, yeah. yeah. huh? yeah, my money is finishing. So this one, you, so this one goes for, this one is 5,000. Of course. So this one goes for 5,000. I'll convert in Kenyan shillings and also US dollars and then I'll write them down below. Thank you, Sebo. You put what? Put inside. Yeah, I'm not Sebo. Yeah. Don't worry. 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 Don't they go for 2000 as you can see the label right there just back in kenya you will get tags so it's very easy for you to know the price of the fruits and vegetables so you give us for 2000 this one we here. have this one mm -hmm. so it goes for 2000 the mangoes yeah. sweet mangoes Guys, we're remaining with 10,000. So let's see what 10,000 can get me here in Owino Market. Thank so you. let's go. Thank you. Nyago. Yeah, <laughs> what else? You need plenty. Green bananas. We have the remain. Maybe Irish. No, thank you. Is, um, we are here, we want to buy Irish potatoes. Irish potatoes, they go for 3,000 Kenyan shillings. So I have 10,000 remaining. Yes. Where are you? Are you the In Uganda, it's called where are for free. Oh, one that is for free. Oh, for free. Hey, hey, hey. Any of these people still use nylon bags? Yes. As you don't use. Them. Then what else do you still need? I need that fruit. How much? How much? Uh, it's too big. Long time. I'm already recording you long time when you're playing. Long time. <laughs> then you'll get a, a, a sebo. No, no, no. Sebo will say, I want to tell you what I'm doing. 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 How much am I remaining? 7,000. Like like mm -hmm. We cut it like that. Ah, like this. Okay, we put. Okay, so guys, I'm remaining with 7,000 7, Ugandan shillings. I want to get this one. This one goes for 1,000. So you can touch for me or to cut it for me. You say, I almost call him. Yeah. Yes. Is it Nyebo or Nyabo? This <laughs> 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 I am going to buy katunkuma. They are commonly referred to as bitter berries or African eggplants. I have never seen these in Kenya, but they are very popular in Uganda. So let me know how you call these things in your language. Uh, katunkuma can be used to cook stews such as beef, fish, and even chicken, and they serve as medicine. So each was going for 500 Ugandan shillings. We bought two. That is 1,000 Ugandan shillings. How much is this one? One thousand. You give us. I'm buying this one. One thousand. One thousand. That is what? French beans. French beans. Okay. And here is what? Green pepper. So guys, again we are buying mangoes. Again, we are going for three thousand Ugandan shillings. Three thousand. Yes, Sebo. Two thousand. This one two thousand. Four thousand. This one four thousand. Is it Sebo? Ah, is Sebo? How much? They are five thousand. This one is Yeah, this one is Yeah, let me show you. Yeah, Sebo. So. Oh. 
So guys, I'm out of this market and basically that is what um, 20,000 Ugandan shilling can get to here in Owino market which I believe is the largest market here in Uganda. So I'm out. Um, let me know what you think about this video. I really really appreciate for your support. Drop your comments in the comment section below. Also don't forget to give this video a like. So as I've said, it gives me vibes of Gikomba market. Gikomba market is the largest market in Nairobi, Kenya. So it's just similar. Here you will get everything basically from fruits, vegetables, you get clothing, beddings and every other thing that you'll need. So thank you so much for watching. We are getting out. This is what I've bought. Um, it's a lot. So as you can see, we have bags, we have vegetables, we have fruits, second-hand clothes as well, just like in Gikomba where we have um, second-hand items. Look at this one. Yeah. We have fruits. So if you want to come to Uganda, don't forget to visit this market which is the largest and trust me you you will get every other thing that you will need in this market we have kitchenware we have like everything is here guys we have everything guys we have any everything drop your comments in the comment section if you are if you are a ugandan let me know by just dropping your flag there i really really appreciate it until the next one guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to give this video a thumbs up until the next one goodbye guys